This version of the back extension is all about working the lower back, the spinal erectors, the columns that run um, up alongside the spine in the back. So um, again, you still want the support pad low enough that your hips can kind of move a little bit just because it's uncomfortable if they can't. But what we're focusing on here is spinal flexion. So you'll notice I'm not keeping the back rigid and flat. I'm allowing it to flex forward um, because what those spinal erectors do is they extend the spine. And if you don't allow it to flex and lose its rigidity, then they can't extend and the muscles can't work work, um, at least not in any way other than through a static contraction. So this is the way to do it. I typically like to do these unweighted just because I can really focus on what the muscle feels. It's not something where you need to add a ton of weight to it anyway.